HDTV in association with Illingworth and Gregory. David, really good game today at Brighton, one all draw. Give us your overall thoughts immediately after the final whistle. Both teams wanted to win. I think you have seen this. Um, it was a draw which we accept. I think it was a deserved point. Uh, we were able to win it, but we were able to concede a defeat as well. Mm. I think this is a result if both teams wanted uh, really to win this game. I think it was a good game. It was, a, from my point of view, a real good performance from the lads. Uh, they have shown bravery on the ball. They played some decent football and they defended uh, with spirit, with fighting spirit. And at the end, uh, we have this point, I think, where we uh, can live with. Where I'm happy about is the performance. This was a performance where I'm very pleased with. The players have, as I said, shown of a lot of good things in a difficult uh, stadium, Brighton away. They have uh, as well this uh, promotion atmosphere still alive, uh, which we have in our home stadium, in the John Smith Stadium as well, and um, to show the performance the players have shown and to respond mm. like they have responded today because the first uh, four or five minutes were very difficult and uh, the goal we conceded was very unlucky but the player responded always in a positive manner and this was what I really liked. The goal that we scored through Steve Mooney, yeah, I'm sure people will focus on the mistake that Shane Duffy's made but I think it's important to say that the, the players off the ball have done the jobs there and almost forced that mistake. You can see Pritch is showing him only one way and then he's, uh, Steve's alert to the situation as well. The players deserve credit for creating that, don't they? Yeah, we, we, we had a totally different mindset today against this opponent uh, compared to the last week. We wanted to chase them high, we wanted to, 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 to go in their face. Uh, to force them to, to mistakes or to uncontrolled uh, long balls and I think over a good period of the time the players have done it very well. We uh, won uh, seconds and uh, we were, as I said, decent on the ball and yes, uh, this was a goal which was a mistake, of course it was, but we were able to uh, capitalize uh, out of this mistake and we forced them to this mm. mistake and at the end if we score goals out of mistakes or not, uh, who cares? Uh, it's important that we score and today we came back after we were 1-0 down. Uh, this is very important for the confidence and for the morale as well that the players have done this today uh, away. What is always not the easiest uh, thing to do and I'm absolutely happy with today's performance. I thought we were on top in the second half, even before David Proper got sent off for the challenge on Jonathan Hogg. What's the early look of Jonathan? How's he looking? Because he was forced off the pitch in the end. Yeah, hopefully it isn't as serious as it was last season with uh, Kutcher. Uh, we have to make further assessments and then we will see. I think it was another uh, very dangerous tackle. Uh, last week uh, we lost after a comparable tackle Kashunga for three months and uh, today uh, hopefully Hoggy isn't a serious injured but we have to make further assessments. How much is it a real quandary for you and the staff on to make changes when we are down to, to 10 men against the opponent of 10 men? Because we're playing so well at that point and the chances are still coming. I'm sure the temptation is to throw more attackers on but you almost don't want to disrupt the good things that the team are doing on the pitch. Yeah, I always had the feeling uh, we have flow in our game and uh, we put pressure on them, we created crosses, we created moments uh, and this is why I didn't want to change the setup and uh, at the end we brought Lolo on and uh, Colin as well to get another tar target man into the box for this crosses and for the corner and uh, then we had the last <laughs> big opportunity from Colin Corner on the far post which we unfortunately uh, didn't use but Again, I think for all of us it's very important that we are focused on, on the performance at so the minute. Uh, um, don't moan about uh, how many points uh, we maybe lost today. Be happy that we have this one point because we have to be honest, we were able to concede a defeat as well. So it was a deserved point with a good performance and this is um, where we can build on. Uh, from this performance we create now uh, the atmosphere next Saturday which we need 
that we play at home for sure this is a small advantage and mm. we have to make this small advantage to a bigger one if possible and for this we will pray we will prepare us in the next week absolutely it's been a, overall a really positive day for the team and like you said not just one but two home games coming up now which i know you always love playing at the john smith stadium david yeah absolutely um this is of course always something we are looking forward to after this ex uh, excellent experiences is which we had uh, so far uh, together in this season and the season before and i think the players deserved uh, every support the best support uh, which they can get and uh, i have every trust and faith in our supporters that they will uh, be there and do it we'll finish with the supporters david it's a long way to brighton as you well know now from from your two years here but they were they were here in great numbers today and, and did your team proud once again and at the end I felt they really showed that they appreciated what the players did. Yeah, absolutely. I'm, I'm so pleased for the supporters as well that the, the players delivered them a performance where they can be proud about and uh, a performance which they can cheer. I think, uh, as I said, uh, the players have done brilliant today offensively. They were brave defensively. They have shown the terrorist fighting spirit and our supporters helped them to perform like they've done today five further games, five further opportunities to get points on the board and we need further points but we play this five games with a good performance in our back and from a starting point where everybody I think before the season would love to be in the position which we are and this has to give us all the confidence and bravery uh, to continue. David, thanks for joining us. Thank you.